Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan broke his three-week-long silence on the murder of Saudi Arabian journalist Jamal Khashoggi. Addressing the parliament on Tuesday, Erdogan revealed that there are strong evidence that Khashoggi was killed in a premeditated and savage murder at the Saudi consulate in Istanbul on October 2nd. The information and the evidence that we have so far collected indicate that Jamal Khashoggi was slain in a vicious, violent murder. And there are indeed strong signs that the incident was not a, thing, a, a momentary issue or a momentary result of something that erupted on site, but rather the result of a planned operation. And of course, in light of the existing information, the following questions still are relevant. So all 15 people who have backgrounds that are in one way or another connected to what happened or what was planned. Why was this team of people assembled in Istanbul on that day, on the day of the murder? Who gave the instruction to these individuals to come to Istanbul? We're looking for an answer to this question as well. Now, as it is, it is now clear, of course, there was a murder and it was clear from the beginning. Then why was there a slurry of uh, incoherent statements? And now there is official acknowledgement that there was a murder. Where is the body? Why do we still not have the body? If the information that the body was given to a local cooperator, co-conspirator, and this is information by an authority, by the way. Now my question is, who is this local co-conspirator? He said the murder was planned by the so-called hit squad arrived in Istanbul ahead of Khashoggi's disappearance to scope out a forest. Erdogan also called for the suspects to be tried in Istanbul. Khashoggi, a columnist for the Washington Post, is known as a sharp critic to the Saudi Arabian Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman. He disappeared after entering the Saudi consulate in Istanbul to obtain documents for his upcoming marriage. Then left the country again.